This is the most frequently asked binary tree question in Facebook interviews. So given a binary tree of unique values and two nodes which exist inside the tree, return the lowest common ancestor of the two nodes. Let's say we're given the nodes 6 and 4, the lowest common ancestor of the two nodes is 5, so we can return the node 5. Let's go over the dot process for each of the nodes inside the tree, we can first recursively search for the two input nodes in the left and right subtrees. Now, if the two input nodes exist in different subtrees, then the current node is the lowest common ancestor. If the current node is equal to one of the input nodes and the other node is in the subtrees, then the current node is the lowest common ancestor. Let's go over the code, create a custom class to keep track of the ancestor, implement the function lowest common ancestor, taking the roots and the two nodes, initialize an ancestor, invoke the helper method, then we can return the lowest common ancestor. Now let's implement the helper method. If node is null, return false, recursively search the left subtree, recursively search the right subtree, check if the current node is equal to one of the input nodes. If the node is found in different subtrees, or the current node is equal to one of the nodes, and the other node is found in the subtrees, update the ancestor, return false. Return true if the node is found within the left subtree, the right subtree, or the current node.